Hello, Whimsy Ray fans. This is Rachel. Okay, so I think I showed a little bit about Vivica Fox to you the last video I did. And if you didn't get a chance to see it, go ahead, subscribe to my channel, click the notification bell so you can keep up to date because I'm always creating something. And I don't always post like I'm supposed to at a certain time on a certain day. So best to click that notification bell and subscribe to my channel so you can kind of keep up with what's going on. I have a lot more coming your way, especially when it comes to textured art and mixed pours. Because I've discovered that that right now for the project I'm doing is the best way to do things. So this, without further ado, is my completed Vivica Fox. I did her, part of her hair adorned in a, kind of like a, it's a glitter gold with like a ruby colored red. She's got Swarovski crystals as jewelry and a silver necklace. She's got a mixed pour as a background. It has some depth to it um, in the composition. There's lightning like gold um, strikes that are coming from her and to her, the kind of radiating off of her. Um, basically, um, with this mixed pour is I kind of wanted to do like a yin and yang kind of thing almost with the blue and the red opposite of the blue. And then there's this darkness that's trying to overshadow her. Um, basically, that darkness kind of represents the things that people have to go through their life struggles and how they break through. Sometimes there's just a small amount of um, hope um, that comes across in life sometimes after so much effort um, that you you make to try to do something. So that's what this painting is kind of trying to represent. Um, I could go in depth a little bit more about it, but I just wanted to share a little tidbit about her. Of course, my signature, and then this is sponsored by the Wilmington Arts, Arts Council here in North Carolina. And I'm um, starting out just to share with you a little bit about what's going on with my channel right now. Right now, I'm just sharing with you um, uploads of tidbits of the art that I'm currently doing because with the project I'm doing, it's 20 famous women, 20 famous black women that I have inspired me in my lifetime. I have been drawing and painting and doing various types of art for the past 20 years. I would say right now, acrylic, um, Acrylic pours is part of the painting part of that I'm doing, um, and textured art is kind of my signature. I have a website, whimsyraysartistry.com. There I have a little bit more detail about myself, as well as on my Facebook channel or page. <laughs> I have a little uh, video here on my YouTube channel about myself as well. I am starting off with commission pieces along with the 20 famous black women that I'm doing. Um, as you can see, the textured art that I do, um, I know it's a little bit crooked, but that's just some of the smaller canvases and um, art that I have done and I am doing, continuing to do. So in this video, I'm going to share with you real quickly um, some of the, or well, yeah, I'll try to share with you all 20 of the famous women names that I'm doing. And what I'm going to do is go back edit the title of these videos that specifically share about these women and the photos that I'm doing about them, a little bit of information. Um, basically what I want to do to do um, with sharing with you about Vivica Fox is just that uh, the strength in a lot of the black women that I've kind of grew up around on television, music, people that have inspired me through poetry like Maya, um, I did a drawing of Maya Angelou um, and I did a textured mixed media piece on her. All of these women are on a 16 by 20 canvas that has been treated with gesso so that they'll last a long time. And um, I have sold one of the pieces already. I'm super excited about that. That really made my day. It was to a local um, person that liked to collect art here in Wilmington. And so what I, my goal is to eventually take all of these pieces, the ones that don't sell right away, go ahead and look, look for a local gallery and or a place to um, exhibit these and then um, go from the local community as far as commission pieces to the across the United States and then all over the world. So I'm super excited because this is just the, the 
tip of the iceberg for Whimsy Ray's artistry. Um, I, lo I look forward to making videos of how to paint, how to draw, how to make mixed pours. I've kind of dabbled in that already, but there is still more editing I feel like that can be done, improvement that needs to be made in my video creations. So bear with me because I am very much learning as I go on art and videos, YouTube, um, TubeBuddy, Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest is a world of its own. So again, I'm learning about all of these aspects as I go to help expand and create um, my niche of followers. So if you are interested in learning and um, again, following me and my 20 famous women, go ahead, like, subscribe, and click that notification bell because I will continue to create more videos as we go. So with that said, without further ado, I told you I was gonna share with you my 20 famous women. And of this, my goal is to put all those women together in a video, kind of share all of the different women that I've done and am doing and kind of share with you different bits and pieces of that, kind of like a little miniature journal diary kind of thing um, in the end. So, and I wanna share that on all of my social media and of course my website. So again, whimsyrayartistry.com is my website. And of course, again, I have a Facebook channel and I have the Pinterest and Instagram channel. I haven't done TikTok or Twitter. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to, or if I even if it's even necessary at this point because of the projects and the focus that I'm really trying to go towards that. Okay, here we go. So Beyonce in blue is one I did. Etta James is one I have done. I'm going to do Mary J. Blige, Ella Fitzgerald, Oprah Winfrey, Nina Simone, Tina Turner, Whoopi Goldberg, Whitney Houston, Rihanna, Vivica Fox, Angela Bassett, Diana Ross, Felicia Rashad, Alfre Woodard, Mila Warwick Fuller, Laura Wheeler, Amonia Lewis, May Howard Jackson. So those are the people that I plan to and have done or would like to draw. And basically what I wanna do is do a drawing and then I will attach that to my textured art. The backgrounds are just inspired by my imagination. I love to do abstract art, but I like it textured. And I like it to be just a little bit of this and a little bit of that. So stay tuned, go ahead, like, subscribe, share my channel with others, my videos with others, so that way they can be inspired as well. This is just the tip of the iceberg. Um, in my art, I just want you to know that I'm starting with my core, like the things that really inspire me, that help move me, and I hope that it will help move you and inspire you. Um, for example, I did a, a couple of videos on my drawing of Tina Turner. I have shared some of the ones uh, that I've done so far, bits and pieces as I go, the different phases, and what I usually do is just share the drawings, and then I'll share the pores, or I'll share the end result, or I'll share something and say, oh, it's not quite done yet, da 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 So if you wanna know a little bit about the process of how I do things, and if you're interested in art or dabbling in art, go for it, it's great. Um, it helps inspire you, it soothes the soul, it just helps um, mediate a lot of different things when it comes to inner, I don't know, depression even, anxiety, it's one of the ways that I cope with those things and um, the current situation that we're dealing with today. So if you want um, ideas, inspiration, check out my channel. Maybe it might help spur on something new for you. Um, if you are doing art as a business and are just looking for that inspiration to keep going, um, subscribe to my channel and hopefully we can kind of encourage each other in this and um, this road to success. Thank you for watching and have a great day.